Hi. Welcome back to Zach's Chapters. And in this video, well, I've got a book with me called An Illustrated History of Tractors and Farm Machinery. I've owned it for quite a while. It's really good. Um, it's quite thick, meaning there's a lot of different cool facts in it, and it's very informative. And I decided it'd be cool to assemble a sort of quiz thing for you guys using the book. So let's get started. They're going to be multiple choice um, questions. A, B, C, and sometimes maybe D. Um, there's going to be a range of different questions, but obviously all related to agricultural machinery. Okay, first question. I know the answers to all of these, by the way. Who began the brand case? Was it A, Jeffrey Increase Case? B, Jerome Increase Case? C, Jeffrey Decrease Case? Who was it? If you know, um, but you can't really put your answer down, it's not actually the chase as much as it feels like it is <laughs> but keep it in your head and i'm about to display the answer uh, pause the video if you need some time to think okay so the answer turned out to be b <laughs> bb jerome increase case if you knew that then well done um, I would recommend keeping an account of your school, but you don't have to if you don't want to, it's completely up to you. Uh, if you do, consider putting it down in the comments so I can see what you got. Anyway, on to the next multiple choice answer question. Okay, the next question is a uh, four choice answer. Uh, yeah, four answer choice for this one. And the question is, to create the brand Massey Ferguson. Ferguson merged with Massey something. What's the second word? A. Harris. B. Chalmers. C. Far. And D. International. I love doing this. I want to run a quiz show when I'm older. Alright, again, uh, pause it if you need time to think. And here comes the answer. Oh. <clears throat> and the answer is... A. Harris. Um, Chalmers was the second word in... Alice Chalmers, a now bust tractor brand that used to be quite high in the market, but obviously they don't exist anymore. Um, what other ones were there? Far. I think quite a lot of you will know that that used to be a brand as well that have still left their chase in the world by merging with Deutz to make Deutz Far and. International, a very well known brand, and they used to make really cool tractors, but that brand doesn't exist anymore because they merged with Case, created by Jerome Increase Case, mentioned earlier. <laughs> and now we've got Case International. It's actually called Case IH, IH standing for International Harvester which was international because international made tractors as well as fasters. Okay, next question. Which one of these is not a Ford cell tractor? But which one? A. The E27M Major. B. The Model F. C. The Model M. 
the Model T. Again, I'll give you a chance uh, to pause and think. And the answer is uh, D, I think, Model T. Um, it wasn't the Fordson Model T, it was just the Ford Model T. And it was a car, not a tractor. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm fairly sure I'm right in saying that it was the first car to go in mass production, not the first car ever to be made. Because that was made by Carl Benz, I think. I'm not really a car guy, I'm more of a tractor guy, obviously, but I'm fairly sure that I've just given you a load of lies, actually, probably. <laughs> I'll check my information in a bit more. But yeah, the Model T is a car made by Ford, not a tractor made by Ford. Okay, question number... Uh, four? It's this. There was once a British manufacturer known as A. David Black. B. David White. C. David Brown. If you're a classic tractor fan, uh, then you're, you're gonna know this. It's a really easy question. I just saw one of the tractors. I knew about them beforehand because they're really famous. But I just saw one of the tractors and I thought I'd do a question about them. I reckon most of you will get this wrong, but don't be upset if you don't because they don't exist anymore and they are a classic tractor. And if you're more interested in the modern ones, or you have modern ones, then you might not really know about these. And the answer is C, David Burke. Okay, so that's the end of the video. Um, I hope you really enjoyed it. Feel free to put your score, if you're a cross note, down in the comments. Um, but you don't have to, obviously. Do what you want with it. Keep it to yourself. If you want. So, bye, and I'll catch you on the next one, which should hopefully be on Wednesday or Thursday. And if you haven't guessed what it's going to be, it's going to be of our new mower. If you haven't seen my community post about that, we've bought a new. Um, MTD, ride on mower, without a mower, so it's not a mower, it's a garden tractor, but um, yeah, we've got a new garden tractor, we haven't actually seen it in person yet, but we've been sent pictures and videos of it, it runs perfectly well, it's petrol, uh, I think it's basically just a newer version of the lawn flight we've got now. We'll still be keeping the lawn flight by the way, and still working on it trying to restore it, uh, no, not trying to restore it, we're going to get it restored, just think positive, you know, everyone underestimates the power of positive thoughts, <laughs> so yeah, on Wednesday we'll be going down to my friend's farm, and they'll be giving us it for free, which is very nice, and very kind of them, they just didn't want it or need it anymore, and they decided to give it to us and I'm very grateful for that. So well that'll be frequently posted on my channel. Uh videos of it. You'll get to see it running and doing jobs around our woodland. And yeah, you'll get to do loads of different things and I'll do a maybe a little short and a long video on Wednesday or Thursday. But stay tuned for that.